What up, it's Melvin7 here and today is Friday. Hopefully we've got icon swaps and icon uh, SPCs, but we'll have a look. Uh, so, oh, we do, we do, and I am so happy that I sold my Luis Figo because now he has an icon. We've got, is this swaps? I feel like this is swaps or are these the actual SPCs? Let's have a look. Uh, we'll see if there's anything else, but I am so happy I sold Luis Figo because I knew, I had a feeling that that motherfucker would get um, exactly what he has got here. We've obviously got the League One and the Saudi Professional League SBCs that came out yesterday. Uh, they're, they're absolutely terrible. Um, but yeah, so here we go. We've got swaps. Sorry, that's the other shit. And then we do have Icon SBCs, which is good, uh, I, I believe, anyway. Uh, so we've got loans here. Uh, we'll check what the actual requirements are. So, oof. an 86 for Zanetti, two 86s, an 85, uh, an 80 rated squad, an 84, um, 11 rare bronze and silvers. And the, the pack roads are pretty shit, but oh, okay, that's that's okay, but we'll check what the other ones are. So we've got Van der Sar and Figo. I'm honestly so happy that I sold Figo. I knew that would happen. Oh my god. An 89 for a mega pack, an 88, an 86, an 87, um, an 82, an 81, uh, and then the bronze and the silver. I knew I should have stocked up on high rated cards. And then we've also got Van der Sar. Now I'm imagining this one will be really cheap. The good thing with the lone ones is on friendlies, you could have an icon team by the end of it. Um, you know, so what have we got for Van der Sar? 86, 85, 84, 82, and bronze, silver. Yo, that's not bad. That one's probably going to set you back about, uh, I want to say about 300k, maybe 250k for that Van der Sar, but it's just his base. Um, so yeah, that's what we've got. Uh, how much are the loans? I imagine they're the same, like maybe an 82 rated squad, something like that. Oh wow, it's not even that. It's just gold players. Okay, that's good. It might be an idea just to get the loans because as I say, you can use them on friendlies. So, you know, when you've got objectives that need requiring uh, specific nations and that kind of thing. Yeah, yeah, it looks as though these are exactly the same uh, for the loans. So it might be an idea just to complete them, store them in your club, and then you've got a bunch of icons for icon, uh, sorry, for objectives. But yeah. We will check and see if there's any new objectives and hopefully swaps are also there, but I, I don't think they are yet. No. So it doesn't look as though there is icon swaps. Wow, is there not... It, there's not an objective player? Really? Nah, come on, man. It's it's a brand new week. Like, it's a brand new season. Unless they, it's coming later, but I, I'm not being an idiot here. There, there's genuinely nothing. Let's check teams. No active event. So there's no objectives, okay, but Icon SBCs are there. Now, in terms of the price, we'll see how long they are there for. I'm also going to see if there's anything else that they released. Uh, the Lewandowski player of the month actually looks pretty good value, to be honest. 285s and an 86, you're getting uh, tradable packs. Not great packs, granted, but still, that Bamba is a fucking joke. Honestly, if you do that, um, I just, yeah, I, I, I don't think you're, you're clever if you go out and do that Bamber SPC. Three, uh, two eighty six is an eighty five is just a joke. But yeah, um, so the icon SBCs are only there for thirty days. Oh, for crying out loud, man! Ah, oh, what this means is that unless they update it like they did on a previous FIFA where they, they made it unlimited, it just means that we're going to have these three and then they'll put another three in that have a time limit and it, it, it limits you in being able to work towards them. So this Figo, I don't know how much he's going to come in at. I, I'm going to guess, let's see, we've got an 89, 88, 86, 87 and then negligible packs other than that. Uh, sorry, uh, players other than that. So I'm going to Yes, Figo's probably going to come in at 600k, maybe, at a guess. Now, on the market, it might be a bit more. I, I don't know how much an 89 rated squad is going to set you back. But yeah, Figo on the market, I sold for just under a million today. Uh, let's see what he goes for now. 
Yeah, people are starting to list. Look at that. Oh, my days. <laughs> he's just going to keep going lower and lower and lower. But he's 900k. I'll see if Footbin have a price. I highly doubt it since it's really, really early in. Uh, but, yeah. I th I'm going to have a look at the Van der Sar price as well. But, yeah, I just want to see if Footbin do have... Um, prices but i should have stacked up on high rated cards no so the prices aren't coming in yet uh but again i, I would imagine figo is going to settle at around 600k van der Sar, i would say is probably 200 to 250k roughly uh let's see how much his baby goes for on the market can't imagine it's too much being a goalkeeper yeah i mean he's probably going to drop to somewhere around 200k to be honest He's 300k on the market. And what was the other one that we had? It was Zanetti, wasn't it? I can see a lot of people potentially doing Zanetti. I need to see his requirements again. Uh, I, I think at a guess he was about 400k. Well, wrong one. Uh, it was the 88 Zanetti, wasn't it? Yeah. I believe it was the 88 Zanetti. I'll go and have a look. But oh, Wow. Okay, so he's 400k on the market. Hmm. Let's go and have a look what he was again. But I... I mean, I'd call it a dub if they had no time limit because I miss Icon SPCs and I can't wait for them to release, you know, the, the good ones, like the really, really OP ones. I, don't get me wrong, I enjoyed using Figo. I think he's really, really good. But for 600k, I, I don't think I'm going to be doing that one, to be honest. Um, I don't know if I'll do any of these. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Uh, 286 is as an, and an 85 as well as an 84 right so that's roughly what bamber is just at about 40k because the other one's 50k maybe so what well, how much is bamber okay zanetti's going to set you back about 400k um we'll go back to van der Sar just so we can get an uh you know a rough price uh for these two so an 84 85 86 so an 85 and an 86 is gonna set you back i think kadira that's what the kadira is i know i didn't do a video on kadira um it's a good card but i don't know uh, i don't think it's really for me personally right so yeah you're looking at about 250k roughly for van der Sar. and again there's no 89 rated squad on there yet so i've just got to use a guess for figo but i'm guessing i think 600k is a is a pretty good guess i'm sure there's an 88 rated squad somewhere for one of these cards um son i think isn't it one minute if i can find son i think he's got an 88 rated squad that you need to put in or an 87 at least wait there no i want to search the sbc son human son let's have a look yeah he's got an 88 so the 88 sets you back at 241,000, and the 87 is roughly 200 so oh okay okay figo might just be a bit more than that figo might be coming in at closer to seven hundred and fifty thousand coins uh i don't know i mean all of them are practically what you can go and buy them for on the market anyway and they're tradable so it depends if you've got a ton of untradables you really want the card you like the icon but for me until the price is settled down because the 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 high rated fodder is probably going to go up right now so i wouldn't recommend you do them straight away uh, unless you've got no tradables and you just really want to but yeah I, I would wait to see what first the icon settler on the market and two what high rated fodder does so if figo comes down to 500k by the time he ends then maybe it's worth it but at the minute i don't think completing any of these is wise uh, and i would just wait and as I say, do the loans. I genuinely do the loans because you never, especially if you're like me and you do every single friendly objective, do the loans. Because, um, yeah, I mean, they'll be worth it. I'm just going to make sure that you haven't dropped any new items. Uh, so if we go under items releases, uh, if it decides to show us. No, because they're the season rewards. Doesn't look as though there's a promo. I'm going to 100% check on Twitter. But, um, yeah, I don't know. Uh, it, it's a disappointing return, I think, for the icons, in my opinion. I think it's just just a bit too expensive. Just a bit too expensive. But what do you think? Uh, you know, I'm glad they're back. 
and hopefully we can get some better players later down the line of course but hopefully you have enjoyed subscribe if you haven't already like the video and yeah peace